Before we get started guys, make sure you guys use my Astro Creation Creator Code down below in the description to make a free account on AstroCreation.com. If you click the link down below in the description, it'll take you right to AstroCreation.com. You'll be able to make an account for free and you'll help your boy out when the game releases. So go do that. Let's get into this shit. What's up everyone? Welcome back to the channel. This is your boy Falco. Today we have another episode of Falco. Lightning takes, fast takes. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think sounds better. Lightning takes or fast Falco, takes? Falco Flight. Falco Flight. I'll go. Uh, oh, you see, you said it. <laughs> I was like, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> but. You're not sold. I'm not sold. I really not. Someone comment down below. These are just takes. Basically, what this this little segment is, it's a. a I, it's not really a short video because the last one was like 15 minutes. But we're going to be. I'm going to be asking a question. Me and Yami, we're going to be talking about it. Uh, if we may give some unsavory, yeah, I like that word, unsavory takes, um, and, <laughs> hey, you guys might not enjoy them, but fuck it, dude, like, like, and the, the one today is one that's de definitely unsavory, and it almost, it almost split the freaking Ash of Creation community in half when this shit went rampant a, a year ago, but fuck it, let's split it again, let's split that shit in fours. Um, mm. the corruption system, boys. The corruption system. How do you feel like the cor the corruption system should be? Obviously, we've never played the game yet. Uh, we don't know how annoying it's gonna be. How the corruption curve? How many kills of corruption? Like, let's say I kill your ass three times. How effective should I be after like the second one, the third one, the fourth one, yada yada, and so on and so forth? So first. And if, I, if I don't fight back? Yeah, if you don't fight back. If you're just freaking, you just left the encampment of Winstead, and I just came up and as my freaking what's called archer and just lit your ass up. Like, how <laughs> many times mm -hmm. should it be before? And this is when we're at uh, equivalent level, obviously. This isn't if you are like a lower level. Mm -hmm. Um, cause I'm assuming, cause we already know if they're a lower level, the corruption system's not gonna be as forgiving if you kill, if you're level 50 and you kill someone who's like level 20. Um, if we're at the same level, how many times should your death without fighting back be, you know, costly? And how should it go down? Like by percent, if you could give me a percentage per, per uh, Yeah, yeah. A breakdown. Yeah. So one kill in cold blood, you should be like like the first the first drop off should be steep you should go from 100 percent effectiveness mm -hmm. to like 67 percent effectiveness you should you should lose a third of your output the really? damage and healing everything maybe you should even get a like a like a like a slow on you like mm. you should lose, lose a little bit of speed make it a little harder to escape it should be it should be intense if you're gonna go if you're gonna you know five star up and go dummy on someone mm -hmm. then i mean 67 percent if you and then if you if you somehow manage to get another kill at 67 percent effectiveness then the penalty should be a little less like go down from 67 to 50 so you're still in that same ballpark mm -hmm. two-thirds effective versus 50 percent effective mm -hmm. and then from there it's i think it should it should taper off it should asymptote down to like after like say 100 kills you should be at like somewhere around 28 to 30 percent effective you shouldn't go below that okay okay i so, mean i don't think anyone's gonna even try to attack anyone if they can, if they're hitting 50 percent that, that's they're probably not i think 50 percent people are going to die easily if they can't if they're only putting out 50 percent of their damage you're not and, killing and taking no one. Twice the damage right. or something like that something crazy, something crazy like that right but if you're really good at the game because some people are just twice as good as other people that's and true. it looks like Ashton is going to be skill-based combat. I agree. I agree. I mean, so, at 50% effectiveness, I'm sure someone out there could whoop my ass. I feel it. I don't know. I feel like... Uh, what, do you think, what do you think the third should be? I feel like after your first kill, you should probably go like 80%. 80. Okay. And then like and your then? second kill... If you if you get back if you're going rogue and like a motherfucker and you get a second one without getting any like doing any corruption like debriefing like to get that down you should probably go to like probably like seventy I think every ten percent because I don't think anyone's gonna be doing you're gonna be killing like that if someone if you're fighting someone equal to you uh, I don't think you're beating someone 
from like 80 to 70 percent i don't think you're you're gonna definitely be at a disadvantage you may be able to defend yourself you may be able to get away um i think you're gonna be more so running at that point um you're not gonna be trying to fight yeah because you're gonna be like oh shit. i agree um unless you are the only time i think that would be different is if you, the person is fighting you because we know the combat triangle is going to be a thing um let's say it's a you're you're a mage or you're fighting yeah you are a mage and you're fighting an archer who's corrupted you may be you may, it may be still kind of equal because that dude has a innate like super effectiveness against you you know what i mean yeah so yeah it's a little it's a little different I feel you know what I mean? so i think 80. yeah i mean if you're picking if you're, pick, if you're picking the right prey corruption right. shouldn't be that but an issue right right um but i remember since we watched that video we talked we we saw i think it was like an asthma goal video or something like that where he was interviewing steven and that was during, before alpha one like a year before it um he steven brought up the thing of being able to after you go on the killing spree and then i guess you get your corruption down um there's a way for you to make it so the next time that you get your get corruption it's not as effective like like let's say mm -hmm. i get i get three kills and then i work off that corruption and let's say initially that first kill game got me to 80 percent effectiveness the next time i might be 85 effective because i work off like some of my previous i guess debt like my notoriety because i guess you become i guess more no you have more notorious you're more notorious you know, sorry more about that notorious. you feel me you're more notor notorious yeah. so your corruption goes up quicker um the, the second time you go yeah. rogue you know but it was weird when he mentioned that he said it's a it's a what did he say what was his wording he said work through progress. a mechanic we've not yet revealed to the community yeah you can work off previous like kill streaks like, or killing sprees basically like previous notoriety i guess what he's yeah, talking about previous Claims of notoriety. Yeah, basically saying that. So, yeah. What do you feel about that? Yeah. Uh, I feel like it could be abused. Like I get it. If if you somehow pull off a ten kill streak and work off the corruption without dying, mm -hmm. then you there should be some something in place for if you do ha ever have to kill someone or attack someone again or become a combatant again in the future mm -hmm. that like it because it, it could be i feel like it would be really stupid let me, leave it, let me put it like that it would be really stupid mm -hmm. to make it so if you went on a massive kill streak work it off the corruption mm -hmm. and then say you had a few months of just peaceful playing mm -hmm. and then someone crashed you and you attacked them and then you got mega corrupted because of that kill streak months ago Mm -hmm. There should be a system in place where over the course of a while you can work off your previous uh, claims to notoriety, mm -hmm. but I just hope they balance it right because I could be easily abused. Thing is, we weren't really explained about that notoriety initially. It made sense. It made it made it look like once you work off your corruption, you're back to normal, and the corruption is still one to one. Like, all right, I'm not corrupt anymore. Okay, next time I get corrupted, I'm at eighty percent or however right. wherever the value was. Next right back to baseline right which i mean it was an old interview we watched it was three years ago right. but that's something that he said right but i'm like i don't know if the reason why i feel like I'm, this was a good like fat lightning take or whatever the fuck you guys want to call it um is because we that's saw point, steven man. kill two people like lightning fast with the archer during yeah. the showcase in december Ooh. But he was corrupted, but it didn't seem like obviously he's using GM hacks and he had no cooldowns or anything like that. But I was like, he killed some niggas pretty freaking quick, quick. It didn't even look right. like he broke a sweat. Right. Like I felt like it should lower your accuracy. Your accuracy or something should be lowered after you get corrupted. Like mm. your accuracy, get, right? Like your that's a good one. Right, like your accuracy and your attack and your like because you're you're sweaty. You're like oh shit, I'm being hunted by bounty hunters. You're just not as effective because you're on edge like mm -hmm. i think they should call it like some freaking like insomnia like you have insomnia or something like that <laughs> insomnia that's a really good one all right they should take that all right insomnia is like, like general weariness all right like your, your stamina recovery or whatever they have in place all right is less your your accuracy is less because obviously your eyesight that's a good one that's right. a good one i like that because you're like you're just on edge because maybe you haven't slept for days because you're like shit i have bounty hunters i can't bank i can't do anything i'm corrupted like I am a wanted man. 
Right. Right. It's like, I think that'd be dope. I don't know. I'm excited to see it. I hope that um, that the corruption, said, obviously it's a work in progress and we have not tested it. And we as a people, it seems like the way that Steven talks about the corruption system is that it's meant to curtail people from doing it just to do it and just to, just to like piss people off. <laughs> you know, it's not meant for, it's meant for people to have, to do it. If like someone like, you, let's say someone got, got some loot and you were talking shit and you're like, all right, I'll see you. I'll see you later. I'll be seeing you when you, when you, when you're not with your homies and you see him out in the streets yeah. and you're just like, you know what? Fuck this nigga. Right. <laughs> you know? <laughs> it's on right. It's on site to do it. It seems like he's like, all right, if you want to do it once or twice, cool. Live with the consequences. But if you do anything more than that, kind of iffy, you know? I mean, it's, also, it's also kind of a social check like if like if you're in a group and you're doing a dungeon or something and someone rolls need right. on the item that you wanted right and they didn't need it because they're just they're a mage and they rolled it on a bow and you're like what right like, right you didn't need that you wanted that right. Right. <laughs> right. definitely watch your back right definitely i think i think that's interesting I, uh comment down below how, how what do you think percentage wise if you were to say like a percentage how how much corruption do you think the first kill um in the system should give um to to feel like it would curtail people from you know abusing the system because people are going to try to abuse the system in alpha 2 and that's gonna be great because we need people to try to abuse the system for them to fix the system um to make it actually a, a system that works because if it doesn't if no one respects it then it's it why is it there you know um right but yeah let us know let us know um this one was episode i'm, I'm just calling another hot take because i don't know when these are coming out or which which direction you know hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure you guys like comment down below subscribe hit the notification bell check out the discord check out the streams follow me on social medias instagram twitter tiktok all that down below in the description and use my ashton creation creator code down below click it make an account for free to support your boy um click the link though don't just go to the site click the link make the account it's free it helps your boy out and also go check out the boy yami down below um he also has a youtube channel where he will be making national creation content whenever we can you know whenever we can go yeah. log into the game um but yeah hope you enjoyed the video and i'll see you guys in the next one peace out see ya someone like you and all you know and how you speak